Hello and welcome to the 12th tutorial in the SFML version 3 tutorial series. In this part we're going to be looking at positioning using the Bazia 2 method. We'll be using the source code from the 7th tutorial. If you don't have it, don't worry, there'll be a link in the description. CodeClass 2DJF provides us with loads of useful functionality for moving a node. Most things in CodeClass 2DJS are nodes such as sprites and menu items. We will look at positioning using the Bezier 2 method which allows you to move the sprite around curves relative to its original position. Let's open our app.js file. That is where we do our coding at the moment. So app.js. And what we need to do is create an action. So var right underscore action actually sorry we need to do busier first this is like a little config we're going to set the points to curve around so square brackets and then in here you do ct.p we put zero so I'm going to put a size dot height Divide by two cc dot p one hundred size no on, minus size dot height divide by four cc dot p one hundred by one hundred for a semicolon and then you can do var sprite action as we always have done and in the Actually, we'll do cc dot busier two dot create put free and busier. Obviously, you could substitute what we have coded right here for the busier keyword there, but it just it just helps maintain the code a little better. Sometimes the code that is a lot longer is more maintainable, easy to read, and just generally far better overall and the last thing to do is just run our sprite action so sprite dot run action sprite action save it minimize this and open up the terminal so we can run our project cd drag and drop our project directory onto here and in here I'm going to do cocos run dash p web there you go we have a busy keyword as you can see it just did a low curve from where it was in the middle to to here it went, it went something like this so yeah that's how you do busy curves obviously depending on what sort of curve you want to do you will need to experiment with your config aka the values over here. Little thing to note, you can't reuse action for different nodes. You either need to create a new one or release the old one and construct it again. Recommending you just create a new action for the different nodes. No task for you to do. Try and do some different uh, busy curves. Busy curves are quite hard to get your head, head around and I recommend just reading up on them a little more or just looking at some other physics tutorial, I mean other science tutorials for busy curves and you should be a lot more familiar with them. The next tutorial will cover positioning using the Bezier by method, which allows you to know to curve but relative to its current position. If you have any questions, feel free to message us at support at sonarsystems.co.uk. The email will be in the description. You can comment on this video, just directly message us via YouTube, or the required links for source code will also be in the description. And as usual, thank you for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.